The city of Byron is looking for a new fire chief after firing former chief Rachel Mosby this week. As Kayla Salmon reports, the city says it all came down to basic job requirements not being fulfilled. We first introduced you to Chief Rachel Mosby back in April when she sat down with 13 WMAZ to discuss her life as a transgender woman in a male-dominated job. Mosby began her transition back in 2016 and says her coworkers were supportive. Mosby had this to say about her job in April. I needed to be able to trust them with, with this the way that I ask them to trust me every day when they come to work. Former Chief Rachel Mosby has been the chief of the fire department since 2008. But Byron Mayor Pro Tem Michael Chittister says she was fired for not fulfilling some basic job duties. The chief uh, was required in his job description to maintain, obtain and maintain the certification as an arson investigator. Um, and he failed to do that. She failed to do that. That's one of three reasons outlined in the city administrator's termination letter. That letter also says that the city paid for Mosby to attend a fire chief's training conference in Savannah, but she attended only five of the 21 classes, and that she failed to process business licenses quickly enough, causing business delays. The termination took effect immediately on Tuesday. But Chittister says Mosby did improve the insurance safety rating. Chief Mosby, among other things, was charged with uh, working to improve the ISO rating for the city of Byron. And I will say that uh, he and subsequently she uh, did a great job. In a statement from lawyers, Mosby says while her coming out as transgender at work received local media attention, nothing has distracted Chief Mosby from her duties of protecting the citizens of Byron. Chief Mosby has and maintained all of the necessary certifications for her position, and there is nothing about Chief Mosby's performance that warranted her termination. Back to you. Rachel Mosby tells 13WMAZ she plans to take action.